This energy meter works with the latest Zigbee 3.0 protocol, and you can use it to measure your power consumption. It offers four quadrant measurement and can handle up to 200 amps per phase. Plus, it's compatible with solar and wind power, and it comes factory calibrated with over 99% accuracy. To set it up, connect the neutral wire and the live wire for phase A. Make sure to thread the current transformer around the live wire. Just a heads up, the current has a direction, so if it's wrong, you can flip it if needed. Then plug the connector into IA. Next, let's add the device to Homey. Open the app and add a new Zigbee device. Press the reset button on the device five times until the indicator light flashes quickly and it'll be added. Once that's done, we can check out the power measurement data. If there's a delay and the data hasn't updated yet, just change the current a bit to refresh it. You can see the total power of the circuit and the power for each individual phase. On the Insights page, you'll also find some statistics. For a three-phase circuit, start by connecting the neutral wire, then connect the live wires for each phase to the corresponding ports, A, B, and C. Next, thread each current transformer around the live wires and plug them into IA, IB, and IC. After everything's set up, you can view the power measurement data for each phase in Homey. Since we're filming in a single phase area, we're actually demonstrating with three single phase setups. That's all for now. Thanks for watching.